Is that you, John? Moves the box just long when it's advent. So this is around, this is an epiphonic app, if anybody has heard of it. I thought it said Steve Bell, hasn't it? Yeah, so I thought Steve. Yeah. Did you see that on the screen? Yeah. Welcome to Exploring the Unknown. My name's Steve, presenter, and uh, we're here at 39 De Grey Street um, with the other co-presenter. I'm Brian. I'm the presenter and cameraman. And this is... Oh, my name is Andy Yates. I own the property which we are currently setting. Andy, um, since we've been here, um, it's the first place where I've... I don't know where you're around, but the music box going off. I felt so the activity hit straight away. Yeah. Boom. It was in. I've never felt so I feel so drained and we've only been here what ten minutes and it's already it's just kicking off. We're all feeling really drained. I'm just feeling it's just weird. But Andy, can you just tell us a bit what's happened to you and your experiences at Fetzin and Grey Street? Yeah, well, to be honest, I could go on for hours, but I'll just say a couple of things that happened to me. This, this was actually my bedroom. We've got a haunted music box, which just, it's been sat on yeah. and not, not wound up for two weeks. And so it's just started playing for some r random reason. But when I lived here, this was the, it's a seven bedroom house and was, I lived here by myself. So I picked this one as a bedroom. I don't know why, but it just seemed to be a nice room. And in this room I was asleep. The bed used to be up against the wall outside. And just in the middle of the night I just woke, woke up bolt upright. And there was a girl stood here. And at first I thought it was an actual girl. Because she was so clear of her features and everything. I kept looking at her and she was just staring into my eyes. But she had like tears. You could see where it was like wet down here where she'd been crying. And, and before this, Andy, did, did, did you believe in the paranormal? Do you, do you believe in ghosts? And... No, before I moved to his house, I'm a bit ashamed to say now I was a 100% sceptic. I was the biggest sceptic you could get. And when a knife can move from one side of the room to another, yeah. I didn't I had no idea what 
what the people are doing can we get a knife and go like that can we throw it out it, mm. at that point I mean, it was scary the genuine fear for your life in the yeah, yeah 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 so, that's absolutely amazing and, and the music box yeah I mean that's that's just triggered all of a sudden I mean it's but I just can't get over we've been here say maybe 10-15 minutes and it's so heavy uh, the atmosphere with I've been was blown in the other room was something was blown right across me. You had you'd been touched. I've been touched twice. I mean, the first time I was touched, it was just yeah, it was behind my neck, um, and I asked, didn't I? I, I physically asked, mm -hmm. and if you've just touched me, can you touch me again? And it did. So and also, as well as well, I just noticed the temperature. My, my legs have gone absolutely freezing, but before I it was quite warm. Yeah, but it it's, it, it's gone a lot colder. I'm feeling quite a bit on this leg in particular. Yes, yeah, yeah. So, cold. so there's definitely there's. I just can't believe this, um, the intensity of, of this place, the, the feeling and the, it's just like something's just going to just pant out and um, you must have been, did, did you just have enough and just decide to go or leave, what, what happened then? Well, I lived here seven years by myself mm. and then the last year I got with my girlfriend and she moved in Yeah. and she got pregnant and the further on the pregnancy, mm. more and more activity all the time. And, Yes. Um, things like the uh, the knife being moved and we're having stuff, I've had stuff thrown at me like batteries and stuff before. Um, and when we're being pregnant, it just wasn't a safe place for it. For it no. to be in. Because no. you'd be late in bed at night and you could, could just feel the cold being pulled up over your head. Yeah. And when you're an adult, that's alright because you can still breathe, but if you've got a baby in a cot and something yeah. pulls away. Absolutely. But just not like just wasn't a safe place to mm. talk to a child. Mm. I felt, I didn't feel like I was physically at hand, but just, does that do? Someone's just moved out there. Yeah, so I thought. just done it again, like a little shadow. Yeah. So we're just turning the camera back on quickly, so we just had a moan. I want to see if we're picking anything else back up. There's a lot of child spirits in here, there's a few adults, but there is one dominant adult spirit who rules the rules then. Is is we know his name is John. Mm. And is a uh, is a. I try not to um, disrespect him because I've I've got to come to his building sometimes when there's not a lot of people around. And I try and just can I don't I don't he, he knows that I don't approve of what he did when he was alive. But I don't provoke him or antagonise him. I leave that to other people to do this. I don't have the consequences of what might happen if I'm here by myself, which I try to avoid happening anyway. I don't like to come here by myself anymore. Would you uh, feel comfortable calling out to John? And if we yeah, was here yeah. with you and we could? Yeah, yeah. You would, okay. Well, I mean, we'd, we'd be coming in a peaceful manner. We wouldn't be aggravating him in any way. Yeah. That's great, okay. Are you excited for this, Steve? <sighs> buzzing, absolutely buzzing. Cannot wait though. Let's go and do it. Let's get started, boys. Come on. So this is a room right now where I felt something touched me twice and actually touched me on command. So we're going to do a little bit of an investigation in here. Right, so what do you think we should start with, lads? I think to just I think we should just start just to really ease it in, just just start calling out. And do you, do you want to start, John? In it? Do you want to see if you ask if John's here or? Um, Got really cold. Well, do you want me to try and get him to answer or just by making a sound or... Yeah, and, and any, anything or you can knock something or... I think it is because the, the temperature, I just, it, it's got really cold in here, I just feel... Yeah. John? It's Andy here, you know me. If you want to make yourself known, you can move something, make a sound, Affect one of us, blow in one of our faces, do whatever you want, John, just so that we know you're around us now. Please. I said something. 
Is that you, John? Music box just went off when it said that. Yeah, the music box. Sounds like there's something mm. moving. By the doorway. Yeah. Is that you, John? Come on in. Come and join us. Come on. Is Andy here? Come and say hello to Andy. It means you no harm. You know, you know Andy's not that type of person. It's really weird because I did hear something. Mm. I definitely like there was somebody over at the door or... Yeah. Did you hear that Andy? No, to be honest I never, but I was kind of like my mind was looking at something else. Yeah, yeah you were on high alert a little bit, weren't you? I mean, it's... If there's any other spirits around, I know there's a lot of spirits in this building. If any of anybody would like to come forward. And it's certainly a creepy atmosphere with these uh, dolls and such in here. Like, that's just gone again, where's that music box? It sounded closer. It sounded like it was. I thought there was one in here. It sounded yeah. like it was behind you then. Yeah. yeah. That did sound really close. It's quite. Uh, my ears feel like they need to pop almost, like they're really mm. bulging. I mean, I'd say the atmosphere in here is quite crazy. John's just moving. Andy's just moving out, sorry. There was a doll up here. When we first came in this room, she was a bit closer and her hair wasn't actually covering her face. And as we turned to leave it, the uh, hair just covered the face, which was quite... That was really weird, that, wasn't it? Yeah, it quite spook spooked us, but I felt a little mm. bit, didn't it? But... But why would she be like that? That's freaky, isn't it? Yeah, it's certainly, it's... That is really freaky. It's just a different position altogether to what she was in as well, which I'm just going to zoom in a little bit on her. I and mean, look, she's quite, she's very creepy looking. What's going on? I don't know where that stopped him. The cop's moving. Yeah, Andy just said the cop was moving and... Yeah, if you it is moving, isn't it? It seems like it's moving a touch. It's moving slightly, isn't it? Yeah, you can tell it, yeah. If you look at the shadows behind, you can see the shadow moving. In fact, you children, come and rock this baby to sleep, please. We know you like doing it. Come and rock the baby. Yeah, it's definitely my wackens. It's definitely feel, it looks like it's, I, I, I can feel like a motion in the room as well, which is quite a weird one. Definitely moving, yeah. It is moving, yeah, it is. Keep rocking the baby, yeah. needs to go to sleep. R real slight movement. Well, what I'm going to do for you, John, or any other spirit really? in this so room, well, I'm just getting out of my house. Something like look, look, there's no doors open, is it? So what I've got in my hand right now is an EVP. So it's an electronic voice recorder. And if you speak into this, we'll be able to hear you. So if you feel like coming forwards and actually saying anything to us, if you do so on here, we'll be able to hear that from you. So let me just start that for you. It's not going to harm you in any way, OK? So any spirit who wishes to speak to us, I'm going to place this... In this in this cot with this baby, please come forward and speak to us. I just felt a really cold shiver then. Someone's just walked right through me. I'm just going to leave that for a minute. That cot's moving again. Whoa, the, 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 the cot just moved. I can feel like a buzzing around me. Mm. It's going again. Go on, a bit faster. Come on, rock the baby to sleep. It's bedtime. Give it a good rock. I'm just going to reach in and take this, uh, this recorder back and just see if you've left any messages for us. If you have, I'd like to thank you in advance. Let me just listen to this. Is there any 
spirit who wishes to speak to us. Place this in this in this cup, this beer. Please come forward and speak to us. I just felt a really cool shiver that. So let's just walk straight through me. I'm just gonna leave that for a minute. I've got some moving again. Whoa, okay, the cup just moved. Still a rocket now you can swim. Yeah, yeah it is. Come on, Uncle David, to sleep. It's bedtime. You've been better off. I think I just heard a, a breath on there then. I'm just going to reach in and take this, this recorder back and just see if you I feel like there was a breath on it then. I'm just going to. If I can. So we don't know when I'm, I forgot you had it on actually. Well, I'll keep going here. No, it's, yeah, it's fine. We'll do that. Um, we'll do another one in a minute. Right. That was just... Um, it's been as expected to find a little bit more on there, but it did feel like at the end there was a breath. I'm gonna, what I'll do is I'll look and edit in, and if there is a, vo if there is a, brief, a breath or a voice, something, I'll, I'll mark the tune and I'll put it in the video. So that'll be fine. But that's... But this has been moving. Not like... Extremely fast, or just you can somebody could tell slightly, just slight, yeah, a slight movement. You could tell more from the shadow, which was uh, the music box just yeah, I thought he hasn't heard it just starts it was and stops. So oh, that's and again, again, how can you explain that? It hasn't been on for two, it's a couple of weeks since anybody's touched it, so it's not been wound up. Or, so it's not being wound up for anything, so it's good, but that's it actually work off a spring mechanism, so exactly. There's no logical reason how it can actually be going there. We've been in here in this room, and it, it's in that room, and it turns on, and then it turns off. So I think the children like to play with it. I think the children like to make it somehow make it yeah. play the music. It's kind of like this them is letting us know that they are here. Right. Unbelievable. Um, I, I think I'm going to uh, I'm going to test the. Um, Necrophonic app because I've heard that that's quite easy for them to, spirits to come through and speak. Yeah, definitely. So I definitely. think I'm going to start that up. So we'll mm. be back in a minute when I've got it all set up. So this is the run. This is a necrophonic app. If anybody has heard of it, I thought it said Steve. Yeah, that's what I thought, Steve. So this is necrophonic. So you can come forward and you can speak to us through this device, and it won't do you no harm. For anybody who hasn't heard of this, it's actually gaining in popularity. It's Quite a good device for picking up paranormal. If you're here with us now, can you speak to us through this device, please? Can you just say what? Mm. What? The device here will not harm you. We just want to speak with the spirits in this property. That just said dead. Mm. Who's dead? Is that Sarah? Can't make it out. Can you speak clearer, please? Broke. Broke. What's broke? Sorry. That was weird. Yeah. Oh. Yum. I said yum. What was that? It was a rattle. Did you just make a noise on it? I'd say the noise. Did you die in here? Yes. I sound like yes. What was that? Come on, my phone. 
I was going to say, um, Nick of Fine Cube, but yeah. But it's not even started yet, so how did it start making money when yours? That was weird. Some freaky stuff happening in that time. So the necrophonic app has just actually opened up on Andy's phone and just started making noise, but as we looked at it, it wasn't even turned on. It, like, it, it literally had the start button still there, so that's quite, that was weird. Did you just touch Andy's phone and open the app? What did I just say? Vengeance. Vengeance, yeah. The vengeance. Do you want, what was that? What again? Do you want vengeance against Andy? Yeah. Life. Life. You want Andy's life? What was that? I had like a. T -t 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 Do you have a problem with Andy being here? Told. Told. That music box has just gone off. And the music box gone off again. What's happening in here? Interest. That's an interest. Mm. What? Can you tell us why you don't like Andy Bean in here? Oh, someone's just touched my face. I just felt like someone just touched my face then. Really? Yeah, like someone just stroked my face. Give. Yep. You. Just so give you, give him a new. Give me? Are you trying to give me something? What was that noise again? So we're just going to try the Necrophonic app one more time and just see if we can pick anything up. Andy, would you like to come over here and speak with the Necrophonic app for me? <coughs> you can pick it up and hold it and see what we get through. Spirit. If you'd like to communicate with you, if you'd like to come and speak, you can use this device here to speak to us. It's gone really quiet on you. No. I said dead. Yeah. Spirit, come and talk to us, please. Can you, can you tell us your name? Sounds like a little bit. Die. You ask them if it's you they want to die. Is it me that you want to die, spirit? Sounds like clicking though, man. I don't know. That was weird. You. Yeah. You, it just said you as well. Is that Andy you want to die? Can you say yes or no? Please. Yes. No. D I. I guess try to spell it out. Did that just say Brian? I'm not sure it's a little whisper. It sounded it. like it. Hello? Hello? Yeah. Okay. Andy's. Let's go. Okay, I'm going to stop this now and see if we can get anything back on the EVP. Um, I'm going to give the EVP this time to Andy and um, see what kind of, see what you can get back from it because with it being your property and you being with your spirits longest you might get the best responses. So, let's just press record, there you go, hold that up so the camera can see it. Spirits! Come and say hello, please. Just, if you whisper, we'll be able to pick it up on this device here. Oh, the 
music box was Music working. box, what's going on? It's like it's using that music box to communicate. That's impossible with the music box, isn't it? Yeah, yeah not to be going that long. It's, it's been a while now, like 20 in minutes. In the other room, it's just... Wow. If I see you making my music box go off in the other room, can you come and leave us a message on this little machine, please? It won't hurt you. I just heard like a... I did. I heard something about it. Mm. If you can, tell us your name, please. What, what was that? that? What was that? What was it? It was like somebody heavy breathing behind you. Yeah, I heard it. It was like a, for me, it was like a, shh, 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 like that kind of thing, like a silent caught whisper. On, on, I wonder if it was caught on there. Let's check. Let me just stop that and play it back. Yeah. Right, let's play this back and just. So you never moved though, did we? All yeah. right, lads. So if we can speak. Who's coming from behind you? Yeah. I'm just going to play it back. My legs are freezing. Great. Come and say hello, please. Just if you whisper, we'll be able to pick it up on this device here. Oh. In between. I'll listen back in a sec. I don't know, I was just s static. If you can, tell us your name, please. What? I don't know. What the hell is that? He did pick something up, there was something. Should we complete the silence? Those noises should be there. No, we shouldn't. Let's skip for it. Where was it? Where would you say it was? Then we're going to okay. do that. I think we're going to the wrong recording. Right. right, let's go back. I think it was about 50 seconds. Let's listen from here. I don't know, there's definitely something there, but it's not like, I can't make it out. It's not like a spoken word, it's like somebody's come and like tapped that or something. It's like they've tapped the microphone on it, yeah. Yeah, yeah it is. But that's... I was holding it completely. Yeah, you were holding it completely in your hand in the same way, so that's, that's quite strange. There was another noise earlier on in that. It's yeah, there was, it was the same, it was just like a tap. Yeah, like somebody tapped the mic on it, yeah. Yeah, that's weird. I mean, we've tried the Necrophonic app, we've tried the VVP, do you think we should try the... The old spirit box radio. See if we can get anything with that. Definitely. Is this a good room to Definitely. try that in? I think with what's happened. Yeah, this is. Different. This is quite an active room for us. I mean, mm. do you want to do tip, do that, Steve? Or yeah. If you are if you are in this building, can you come forward and speak to us? That was a strange silence. We need to change, we'll change radio station. We're in the right one. Let's try on AM. Try to scroll through the channels, see what we can. That's like a screaming. Good girl. Hello? If you're there, you can. Communicate with us through the, the radio. Never had such a thing through one of these before, have you? Wow, what is that? Ooh. 
I'll give you this. I'll give you this. You'll give us what, sorry? What was that? Couldn't quite make that out, so if I put, see that in editing, I'll, uh, I'll add it on the screen for you. I'm going to try moving through the channels a bit quicker, see if that helps eradicate it. It's alright, yeah. Don't stop. Or stop or no stop. We'll ship to A at F anything. Let's go. Let's go. Right. Okay, I think we'll turn that off for a minute because it does. It's, it's bringing quite weird responses back. Um, I mean, are they intelligent responses? I don't know. But was. I ain't really? seen the radio, I'd like the spirit box radio, whichever it is. I'd, no, no. I'd like that before I've used it mm. as well, and I've never ever, ever seen it after no, that. No. Some of the noises that came through were like Strange. wartime, mm. old style radios. But then again, who was Bond, and I don't know if there's anything under these foundations, or even if this is oh, post or pre. Yeah. yeah, but it's, if, if it's general location, I don't know if it's pre or post war itself. So. Oh, no, no, it's 1880s or something. This is 1880s? Yeah, yeah. So this is so this is pre-war, so there's a chance that... Yeah, yeah. Right. The man who lived here in the Second World War, him and his son were both ARP ones. And it was one of our, one of the jobs was obviously to raise the siren, to raise the alarm when there was an air raid coming in. But the other job was to take uh, bodies out of buildings and if it was actually stored in the warehouse at the back. Right. They made a temporary morgue there and they stored bodies in there. Jesus. Q fast. We're just gonna go up to the attic now and uh, do a, run another test. See what we can pick up. That's moved as well. What? That box under the under the table that was further back. Let's make our way up here. Abbey. It just said Abbey? Yeah, as I'm in the cows now. So what's the name of that app again, Andy? Pardon? What's the name of, what's the, name of the app that you're using? Oh, uh, Paratech. This is the Paratech app and we've had quite a few interesting uh, things come through. One actually came through with my last name and mentioned magic among some other things. Now, Whoa. when it mentioned it? magic, it was around the time it touched my pentagram tattoo. Yeah, <laughs> what was that? I don't know, it was so... I wish it'd land now. Well, like an orb, it was just like a... What the fly, because I was looking at it. Just like a... You know, like a... Like a stick, but going across the screen. Really? Really? Yeah. like that, and then it just went through that wall. A recording, or are you live now? No, but I should have picked that, but I didn't... Wow. Well, you might as well go live now, just in case you pick anything up as well. So we are going live on this as well. And, uh, are you live now? Let's see what we can pick up. So in this room here, we've been told by the owner that somebody actually hung themselves. Which I think is quite a creepy atmosphere to walk into. Why, on 39 Gray Street, and boy, what a man. So, 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 no! So if you've been what if you've, I don't know if I've mentioned it already in this video, but we were trying to reach out to someone called John, who used to live here, was quite active, and we've just actually had that come through on the Paratech app, which is, it works like an ovulus. And, uh, let's flip this around. So basically that works like an ovulus, and it picks up the, um, it's like a word box, the spirits can actually speak words through that. I'll bring words from the screen in this case. And it's coming up with some interesting correspondence because at one point it's mentioned 
my name is mentioned the partner's name of um, Steve as well as some other things so we'll, we'll keep up it, um, Andy's going to keep up with that and see what comes up seven seven yeah this is what room is this this is a seven bedroom this one and that's just come up with seven oh. wow really creepy see that's creepy as hell if there's any spirits here can you please speak to us through this device we mean you no harm Can you tell us your name, please? Did you die in this property? Or did somebody hurt you here? Does the name Veronica mean it? No. <laughs> it's still going, you can go. Does the name Veronica mean anything to you? Oh, Randy. We've had Randy for only some of Are you here, John? Can you give us a sign, John? Can you tell me what you think of Andy? Or Steve? Who are you? On regular. The name Addison has just come up. Addison? Does Addison mean anything to you? I'm going to stop it there. Fear. Play it back. I've had fear a couple of times on that. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Is there a Michael here? Is there somebody here who knows a Michael? Is related to Michael? Does this Michael know myself? Does it know me? interfering with the microphone. Someone's definitely interfering with the microphone there. Never had that before. No. That's weird that. What? I and mean, it's just... Pencil. Definitely there's something interfering with the microphone there. That was weird. That, that was... I'm going to run the necrophonic app and see if we can... Yeah. Can we prove a necrophonic app? Okay. Is there a Michael here? Please. Please. Is he in this property now? Hey. 
Is there a John here? Was somebody hurt in this property? Dawn. I said Dawn. 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 What's that? Like a growl in the background. Yeah. They say growl on there. There's so been a few growls in here, haven't they? There has, yeah. We heard a growl downstairs before we were up here. Yeah, that's what I mean. Is there something other than a spirit in here? Yours. What was that? What was that? I heard that, yeah. I'll have to look back at it in a recording. Yeah. <gasps> that was creepy as hell. Like a whisper from yeah. somebody. Full sentence. Can you say that again for us, please? Like someone's went shh. Cold. Got like in a morning cold. Yeah. Did somebody die in this property? Men. Men. Study. Learn. And that's telling us to learn. What do we need to study? What do we need to learn? I said look at. I'm just like horses in here. Is there some type of animal in, in yeah. here? Is there some type of animal? Is there some type of animal? Get out now. That's not like get out now. Get out now. That's what it sounded like. Do you want us to get out now? Ooh. <laughs> I felt someone just touched my face then. Did you? It felt like someone just brushed a finger across my face. Do you want us to leave this property? Run. Run? Script. Should we run? Are you telling us to leave? Should we leave? Death. Death? Uh, that sounded like my voice. Did it? Uh, that sounded like my voice coming through. Investigate. We've had that a couple of times. We've had that a couple of times. Yeah, yeah. Are you using my voice to speak through? Are you using my energy? I am. I don't know if I am. I don't know if it is. It's dangerous. It's a danger, isn't it? Yeah. What, what the hell is that? What was that? Oh my god! It sounded like it said, leave here. It was a woman, wasn't it? It was a woman, yeah. Come on. Rape. I just said rape, I'm sure. Rape? Rape. Yeah, I thought you said that as well. Oh my god. I was downstairs when I saw about rape. You did, yeah. I've always got downstairs, I've got the feeling of of being raped in here. And well, not physically raped in not, not described not, it better. No, no, it's um, described as rape. There's, there's, there, there has been rape in here. Was somebody raped in this property? Yeah. yeah. Yes. Somebody was, was raped. I just said daddy on there as well. Daddy? Daddy? Oh, no. Can I show that to the camera? Oh, it's just changed to everything. I'll get everything. Up. Daddy everything. Daddy? Daddy and everything. Daddy and... Scared. Johnny's rich. He's got a few set here. Johnny's too abused. I'll give you that back. Daddy and rich. That's oh. quite a scary thought. That is sick. Was, did something awful happen in this building? I'm starting to feel the mood change. I'm feeling a change in mood, it doesn't feel as safe as it did. No, I feel sick. I feel sick, my head feels sick. heavy and... More. More. Are you making us feel this way? To him. Yes. I mean, like a girl, that. What was that? It's the kid ones that are getting me though. Yeah, I don't, I don't, I don't like the kid ones. 
So good. He just said good. Good. He just said good. Oh my god. So obviously Fetz and Andy Grey Street is is known for, for a lot of children. So we've we've got rape, now our sense rape just on just on the, the landing. And then we've just had Daddy. More. More. That is more. More. They said that is more. Like that. Burn. Burn. Dad. So what I just said dad. 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 Oh my dad. god. So somewhat sickening, somewhat somewhat completely. Was you hurt different. by your parent? Somewhat different. Can you come forward and speak to us? Oh I feel cold. Yeah. And the hairs are standing on end. Listen. Daddy. Daddy, it's a daddy. Oh god, like daddy, two different ones so now. Sick. This is disgusting. It is disgusting. This. John, did you harm your children? Did you see like a little scream? Yeah. Sound like little screams downstairs. Scream. There's a scream coming from downstairs. Like little screams, like yeah. a little girl. That's her. That is horrifying. It, I don't know if the camera's picked it up, but that was horrifying. It was like, ah, ah, like a, yeah. like like a some, somebody trying to scream to, to actually get away. Leave it. Leave it. Don't do. Don't do. Smoke. Why? 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 Monitor. Daddy help. Something help. Daddy help. Do you need help? Please. 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 Did John hurt you? Okay, that sounds like a guy. Yes. That doesn't sound like a nice voice. Do your dad hurt you? Adult. Adult, on there. Was it another adult, not your dad? Was it another adult? Yeah, not dead, I think it just said Ben. Not dead? I'm pretty sure it just came through like in that guy's voice and said they're not dead. Oh, we're not dead? They're not dead. I don't. This is weird. Run. Oh, run. run. I think I said run. Run. Are we so, in danger here? Can we set that foot downstairs? I just heard something downstairs, yeah. There's a massive foot run downstairs. Again. Are we in danger here? End. I just said end. Alive. They're all alive. Do you hear that? Was that the all? The all alive? That's what it sounded like, yeah. They're all alive. Are you watching us? Oh. Are you watching us? Are you out. watching us? I just said out. You're telling us to go, but, but why? Leave. Why, why, why should, should we leave? Why should we leave? We're here to investigate you. Because here. John. I think I'm saying because John. Because of John. I think that's what it just said. Is John here? Go. Go. Where? Where is John? Hello. Where is John? Is he here? Is he going to come up up and see us in the attic? Leave. Leave. This is a, a, Andy. Andy's property. Of, a, do you, this, should Andy leave too? Should Andy leave too? This is Andy. Should Andy leave too? Just. Just. Out. So, I just want to get this to Brian. So you, so you want me, Steve, and Brian to leave, and just Andy to stay? No. 100 army. That's not like something army. Shush. Just shush me. Why are you telling us to shush? Daddy what? again. Daddy again. Daddy! If we leave, what will you do to Andy? Kill him. That's what I'm going to say. Veronica again. If we leave, what will you do to Andy? What will you do to Andy if me and Brian leave? Run. Kill Run. Run. Who is Veronica? A woman going, oh. Run again. We're not going to run. You should. We're run. here to talk to the spirits who need our help. David. Veronica, I think you're here, aren't you, Veronica? Got the side of your neck again? Yeah, it, keeps, it feels like someone's scratching the side of my neck. 
Yo. What's that? I was a kid again. I was a kid. Kill. He just said kill. Intent. Kill. Intent and kill. Intent and kill. Who are you going to kill? Are you going to kill me? Nastily. Nastily. <laughs> That's what I thought he said as well. Who else are you going to kill? Who else are you going to kill? Six. Oh, that was a weird noise. Are you going to kill Steve as well? That was a laughing and Brian. That just laughed and said Brian, didn't it? I think it did, yeah. Die. Outside. Vicky. Dad. Dad. Please mention the word dad all the time, right? Eh? Dad. Thing. I got the feeling when I came here that the spirits were friendly. Why has the mood changed? Is this a different spirit? This is a sick dad, dad hide. Dad hide? That is weird. Is it because Ooh. I'm a dad that his spirit wants to kill me? Kill him. That just said kill him. Really? It sounded like kill him. This is why it was nice and then that was getting and sick love. and evil and rape and dad and... Why? Dad dead. Dad dead, I think I said. Dad dead? Steve Why? is a dad also, do you want him dead? So is Andy. Get yeah. cursed on. There is. Entity. I love. I love. That weird noise again. What, what, what is this? Who so killed him? I've, I've never experienced anything like this before. Newcastle. I just said Newcastle. Newcastle. It is not Newcastle, isn't it? Yeah. Dark. Dark. We've got some really creepy stuff going on since this is Really, 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 really weird. The, I'm just going to grab the camera and we've we've got to it. Four times. We've had a lot of stuff come up with words the same things on this necrophonic app and um, C, saying C. Really, really <clears throat> weird stuff. I've never experience anything quite like, like it. quite like this before it, it's it's been from the moment of, of, of walking in here um no that was like a demonic voice yeah I'm it's, it, it's, it's gone there, from man. it really active uh, to now demonic to perversion to to rape to children we've had somebody a child scream or a faint sound of a scream to Telling us to run to get out. What? I don't know. What's going on? Ian. Do you want to and the atmosphere is. And, and the atmosphere in here is just. It's only like somebody tapping on the window, but we're on the third floor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. but the atmosphere in here is, is just. It, it's just really changed for battery. me. Battery. I just held it. Was that battery? Yeah, I didn't mind that was the battery you had in your hand because I just changed my battery, yeah. yeah. And definitely. Is that dad again? I think it said dad again and run. You've seen dad? And run. And run. Dawn. Dad and run. But, but, but why should we run? Why do you keep telling us to leave? Why? Are you trying to warn us that we should run before something happens to us? Is, is something going to happen to us? Steve. I just said your name. That said Steve. Wow. You said Adam. I just said Adam as in my last name. Adam. New. New. Here's my new last name as well. <laughs> right, you're talking to us on on this. You've just said my name, so so what do you want? To rip. I think that's said to rip. To rip? That's what it sounds like. So so, so basically you want to rape me? I don't think so. Diabolical. Diabolical. Diabolical, that just said on the app. Interest. An interest. Have you got an interest in raping Steve? Aye. That just said aye. Aye. Break. Brick. 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 So it said prick or break. Aye. 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 They're all agreeing now. Aye. 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 That's weird, isn't it? Prick. Prick. He's yeah. calling you a prick. Yeah. Are you calling me a prick? Interrupt. Interrupted, have you interrupted? Have I interrupted you? 
Really? Really? Yeah. You. Yeah. And I'm looking back at you. Hi. Don't, what was that? I don't know, but you're getting quite nasty now and I, uh, and I don't like this. Spirits, if you want to rape Steve, do something now. No. Touch him in a private place. What? <laughs> we can't ask no. him, we can't tell him to do that. No, we can't. 90. Did that say 90? Yeah. Rah! That was, that was, that was, that was harsh. You feel very horrible. Are you a horrible, okay, evil person? Spirit. You're a horrible, evil person, aren't you? Come it's forward like... now and do something to Steve, Spirit. Touch him, touch his head or his hand. Do something to harm him if you want. No. I am. I am, I am. Steve. Watch. Watch. Oh my god. Wars. And that says wars. It actually does as well, yeah. Wars. Sacred. sacred now. Sacred wars. Well, this is getting scary. Do you want to start a war against Steve? We. We? Is it so, it's, so it's more than one. It's more than. Prick again. Prick. It's a spirit Why against you Steve, isn't it? Ready. Run. Ready, are you I'm ready? ready run. I'm ready to run, I'm ready to get out of here. Are I'm a ready? celebrity, get me out of here. <laughs> Steve's ready for your spirits. I shouldn't be laughing, but... Prick. Do something to him now. Why, why don't they like you, Steve? For me, it was, it was like they wanted to kill me. They, they want to, more for they you. They want to kill you, Brad, but now they're calling me a prick, eh? They want to kill you and rape him. Yes. Oh, yes. I don't know which is worse. Steve's ready, feel good. Do you feel good? No, I don't. It's always just come up, it's literally just come up saying <laughs> feel good. Be raped. Hey, wow. That's creepy. That's creepy. That's creepy. Laugh that yeah, way. it was. Getting touched. No. It says I, I feel like someone's touching my leg though. Feel good. Just here. I know my legs are getting numb because I'm... We, again. Ooh. Can you tell us why you want to harm Steve? I don't. I mean, there's loads of voices all together, like in unison. Yeah, that was saying we do. Good. But you do. Deaf. No, don't I don't. I'm sure I said no, don't I don't. Brian. Care. Is that what I said? Care. Yeah. So one says Brian and Care. I, I feel like there's some spirits that are trying to protect me and you, Steve. Yeah. And some that want to harm there's, us. You definitely there's You've got some good spirits in here that are trying to protect us and then there's some Bad. That are bad. Yeah, it just said it itself. It said bad. So this you just finished your sentence. Bad. Yeah. Well can we keep all the good spirits to surround us all and to protect us and to keep us away from the, the evil that, that, you know, that lies in here, can, can you keep us safe? And the fear, fear. Because we don't fear you, because the good in us and the good of spirit can protect us. Do the good spirits fear the bad spirits? Are you fearing them? Saints. When saints. What, what was that? What the hell? Adam. Adam. Jesus Christ. And he just dropped his phone. Someone just pushed the phone on my hand. Someone just pushed the phone on my hand, lama. And he just kind of went, I've got it. That was quite a strange one, that. Something's just either pushed or thrown. What was that? I kind of got pushed out of my hand. Yeah, it did. It slipped. I saw it slip out. It was almost unnatural the way it slipped. Third. 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 F-A-D. Wow. Run again. So some spirits really don't want us here. Can the ones who do want us here, can you can you show yourselves? Can you do something to show us you are here to protect us? What the hell? We have to fight. We have to fight, but why do we have to fight? Be dead. Be dead? Number one. Number one? I wonder if it means room one. I don't know. Because we have got a, there is a room one, isn't there? Here. Here? Yeah, yeah and it's just said there. here. Room one here. Move on. That just said move on. That was an evil voice. That wasn't a nice voice at all. No. We're not listening to you to move on. We're only listening to that of the good spirit. We're not going to um, talk to you bad spirits anymore. We're no, only going to speak to the good spirits. We're going to bank you out because we don't... We, that just, do you hear that? Was that a map on the screen?
That was an evil laugh. That was very evil. That was a really evil laugh. Oh, someone's just touched me. Just beside him. That said beside him, I'm sure it did. Beside are you are you are you are you on my right or on my left? Fatal. Fatal. I feel like someone's touching my neck again. Is it? Yeah. I felt that since I've got it here, haven't I? Yeah. Give. <coughs> <coughs> what 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 do we need to give? Oh God, I just coughed. Come on. You've started this and now we need to find out. Brilliant. Oh, focus. Dead. That's a dead. Is Steve about to die? <laughs> Free. Free? Is Brian about to die? Am I about to die? Pleasure death. Death. Run. What the? Something else. Oh, wow. So many different voices coming through at once now. First. You keep getting that type of thing on there. What was that? I feel like I just heard something downstairs. Intersection. What the hell is going on here in 39 degree street? Do you want to flip that round so it's facing that so we can see for ourselves as it goes on? So see on what on the your camera? Yeah, you've done your live stream so they can see this going on. Um Has one of us gonna die at an intersection? Sexual. That just said sexual. What was that? Sound like a train? Insomnia. I can hear something moving over there. This is weird. Weird. The noises that are coming through though, they don't sound... They sound sinister. What was that? Something code. Nothing. Idiot. Has that just come from there? Who's an idiot? Are you calling one of us an idiot? What was that? We're outside. Free. I thought he said we're outside then or something like that. So many voices coming through at once, I can't discern what they're saying. Spirits, use all our energy and try and do something really strong so we so we're really notice it. Evil. Evil. Over. Is it over? Don't know about you guys, but what you're feeling right now? Incubus, what's that? An incubus. incubus. An incubus is a is a sexual demon. That's a succubus, isn't it? Is it? Yeah, I think that's a succubus, not an incubus. Incubus is. Incubus is, incubus is some sort of demonic thing. Yeah, I think yeah, we'll search that down. Do not. Incubus. Do not. When I've just said search up, it's just said do not. I'm searching up. Uh, I'm curious. It's a demon in male form, according to mythology, a legendary traditions lies upon sleeping women. In order to bring dangerous sexual, sexual activity with them. What? So incubus. An incubus is a male version of a succubus, basically, by the sounds of it. And to do with about sexual dangers. sexual things towards women, yeah. Eh? Well, that's John, isn't it? And that's weird because all the stuff we've had come through about like rape and other stuff. Yeah. There's a lot. Yeah, there's a lot of that coming on. Incubus. Here, and that's come up with incubus and then other. That is weird. Give us some more information, please, Spirit. Here. Yeah. Dude. That's not like the dude. Malice. Okay. That's a malice. Malice. Have you got malice towards one of us? Alright. 
The rat. Hurry up. A lot. A lot. Fro. Oh. Are you going to throw something, Spirit? Fro, hey, Steve, this is an easy target. Look down there. I think I just said Brian again, though, when he said Fro. Run. That was clear as day. Run. Stop. Mm. Torture. And that's just. That's a torture. Oh. Oh, no. We're getting quite a lot of nastiness now, spirits. Really what's, what's changed the atmosphere in here? When we first entered, it was a very nice, calm thing and. Weird. Bad. Yeah, as soon as we've come into this room and the room downstairs, it feels like it's got bad. Weird. Weird. One. Zack. That said Zack. Yeah. I thought it just said John. What was that? Die. I just said go on there as well. Oh, you. I think we should. Um, I think we'll stop. Go oh, we'll, I think we'll pause for the necrophonic app here and. Um, should we go to. Should we finish off in the mirror room? Should we go to the mirror room? Insomnia yeah. again. Right, we'll be back with the live in about five minutes. Real. So we're just heading back downstairs now. We are going to do. Um, an investigation in the mirror room and then finish off in the lounge area. Are you ready, Steve? Yep. Come on in, Andy. The um, atmosphere in this place has just completely shifted from when we first got here. It felt calm, relaxed, and quite nice. Whereas now, it's just a whole different atmosphere. It's completely shifted. And it just genuinely feels like something doesn't want us here. Wouldn't you say so, guys? Is that what you'd say? It just genuinely feels like we don't, something doesn't want us here anymore. Uh, definitely, absolutely, 100%. So, it's just... Um, it's really cold where I am again. Like I'm it? walking through something, yeah. Yeah, yeah, right here, yeah. This spot right it's here really where we are, walk it just feels like you're walking through a freezer almost. Walk What's where I am, Steve? Like you feel it? Jesus, yeah. It's just like a real it's cold weird. spot. It's a. That is so weird. It's just this one spot. You can walk up a corner there, you don't get it. You can walk up there, you don't get it. It's just Why it. is it here? So, this is the room we're going to be hitting next. Oh, and then we'll be finishing up in the lounge. That is weird. But we just need a quick two minute break, so we'll be back in a minute. So, whenever we sit at this table, this thing starts moving like mad. And we're not sure, although we're pretty sure actually, we're going to check in the footage, but it looks like this face has moved. Now we're just going to go live as well as recording this, but... I right, um, we're, we're back people, and um, <sighs> shit. Um, we just came downstairs, and we went into the kitchen, because we needed to take a break, after all the <coughs> shit what was going on and everything else, and that was scary, and... Um, Ray, Death telling us to run and everything else and that and then we, we locked the, the kitchen door um, to stop anybody coming in and the scariest thing was, was hearing noises and things and Brian you saw one of the chairs in the room didn't you, it, it suddenly moved, one yeah. of the chairs and like a shadow w moved across as and well and a shadow that, that moved across then when we tried to open the kitchen door it wouldn't open and then um, we just feel it just felt trapped. We couldn't open it, and I was trying to open it, and things were happening, and it was getting scarier and scarier. It was like shitting out so. And then basically it just wouldn't open and open. I was trying to open and open it, and then and then you tried Brian. Open first time. And it opened first time. 
So it won't let me out, the one that it wanted to, to rate basically, for some reason, and then um, then all of a sudden, um, Brian came to open, the key just opened, and I swear on my Ben's life, it would not open, the door would not open, it just felt like it was trapped and there was the chair moving, there was noise, there was all sorts, and it was just, we just wanted to run, we just wanted to get out of here, end it. Um, that was mental. That, that was, was terrifying. Crazy. This, I'll tell you something, is I've never um, experienced anything like this what we've had tonight. And it's really creepy with all of the um, the messages and the death and the the sex and the rape, the daddy. and It was sick. It was evil. It was... Um, Something's just moved over there behind you. Is it? Literally yeah, in that hallway. Yeah, we're having stuff happening now which is um i feel really uneasy and, and I, I do want to really get out of here um I and i think you know we, we should um i think we should finish up down here and we need to we need to get out of here um it is i feel really sick all of a sudden yeah really, the really feeling sick. of sick and it's just evil and i've never experienced this and that's going again in, in in this house before and there's things moving there's things happening um it's just bizarre <coughs> bizarre mm. but we'll just show you for the live video as well we'll just show you um a flip round so you can actually see oh well immediately you see the, the scary doll um and everybody that comes into this room the fear of god the sea the mannequin and that scared me when i when i come in here and you see that and it just looks like there's somebody just sat down there but there's all types of um objects in here um that's come from all over the place mainly from Ansel market lincoln um all from different locations some that, that andy's bought um across the world and really old items the cctv system there which you can see in the background which is uh looks at all the different rooms upstairs i know it's a little bit blared at the moment but there's just weird objects and things that move and um clowns weird looking dolls and there's so many items in here not just dolls but well there's like an old organ there and chairs there's just loads and it just goes on and on so you can imagine that um all of the the items that are here they will all collect energy um which bounces off so it, it's just i don't know i'm just 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 totally gobsmacked but it's i mean what do you think brian honestly it's um the activity has just gone from not to 100 as well it's just mm. a creepy place i feel like all the objects carry their own energy. I feel cold all down my left side all of a sudden, but... Yeah. I mean, what I can't explain is how the shift in energy... When me and you first arrived, it felt calm. It was. Safe. Yeah, yeah. Um, we had a few encounters, but it wasn't... didn't feel like we were in danger. Yeah. But that whole issue then with the um, with the door, and after it said what it had said, where it wanted to kill me, and it wanted to do... Do you know, know. rape you and it kept it coming through even on the other app that Andy was using saying sexual and otherwise other stuff but it just uh, when you couldn't get out it was terrifying I mean all three of us at one point we like, actually laughed out laughed but not because it was funny but just out of panic mm. and and I could see you were proper struggling against it to open the door you couldn't get it to go no, no, but no, the no, second no. I touched it it just turned like butter and it was it, that was the weird thing about yeah. it but it was like almost it, like it didn't it want you to leave yeah it, it it was just weird, it's just, I just, words can't just, just... I think be, I just saw a shadow over there. Yeah, there's, there's a lot, there's more and more things happening here and stuff like that, but I think it's, um, it's, I think it's definitely time, because I just feel absolutely drained, knackered, um, and I think if we carry it on, um, it's just going to just burn us out, but what, for our first investigation here at, um, 13 under Grey Street, um, exploring the unknown yeah. for the first one. It's it's amazing, absolutely amazing. Let's try the necrophonic app. We don't seem to be getting much with the old radio style. No, not the radio, no. <clears throat> so we'll try on it again. <clears throat>
Are you in? I just said, are you in? Spirits. Is that just said spirits on that? We're going to be leaving soon. Is there anything you wish to say to us before we go? No. Enough, I think it's sad. Enough. Spirits are my game. Oh, yeah. Dead one, that just said. Yeah. Gabriel. Mm. Oh, yeah. I just said Lisa. Huh. Date. Raped. Raped. I just said date and you said raped. That just said raped. Date raped. It's her, whoa. <clears throat> Don't tell her that. I think I just said sex. Raped again. Or Brian. I can't it's remember. It's weird because I'm throwing. <clears throat> uh, That's going crazy spirits. again. Gabriel. Date. A Yankee. Which used to live in America for about 10 years. That's strange. Mm. Yoga. Is there anything you'd like to say to us before we leave? No. We want to thank you for for speaking with us today. I said why then? I think it just said why when I said that. Well thank you for speaking to us and for being so active. Yeah, thank you. It's definitely uh But when we leave this place you you we would you're not allowed to follow us. You stay here, this is your home. You can't follow us, you've got to stay here. Nightmare. Is one of us going to have a nightmare tonight? I think you just said of course then. Burn. Right, I'm going to stop the necrophonic app. So final thoughts guys, what do you think about tonight? Um. <clears throat> I've been here before, and, and, and in all honesty, I've, I've, um... Jesus. I just Jesus, said Jesus. Yeah, that could round it off. I've been here before and that, and I've not, in, in the, I've always felt unsafe when I've gone up to, to the other level, level, and I've always felt like the rape thing, but this is the first time that we've communicated, and it, it's mentioned rape, and get out, and the, all the other ways of pretty, and sexual stuff, and shit, and, and that's just just felt weird, and I just felt uneasy, and I've never really felt uneasy in, in this place. I, I'm a little bit uncomfortable when I go upstairs, but it's from coming in within the first few minutes, you could feel it heavy, but it felt all right. But and then right. and then it just suddenly until we got upstairs, it just suddenly changed, and it, it started to get uneasy and. And then once we put the necrophonic on, it just got out of hand. It just got evil. It just got, That's just yeah. said fear me. I said that twice, doesn't it? Wasn't and it, 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 it said that when we couldn't get out. It said fear yeah, me. Yeah, fear me when we couldn't get out the door and that. And it's it's just been playing games. And it's um, it has been a very intense night. And I think for the, for the first investigation here for um, uh, for us and and for the series, it, it's 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 phenomenal. It's just you, you, the music box going off. It's a wind up one, but it kept stopping and starting. That's impossible for like half an hour, forty minutes. Yeah, yeah. For, for for going on and off, and and it's it's not been in for two weeks. No, um, that's just been out there for two weeks. Exactly. So, so for suddenly for it to start going off, exploring the unknown. Hell yeah. This is definitely unknown, and it definitely wants, I think, to come back. And obviously, um, we will come back. And I think we need to go, obviously, next door to it, which is the um, the haunted warehouse museum, which definitely needs uh, investigation. But 39 Degree Street, it is one creepy, hellish, and that's freaked me out with the the rape and the sex and the kids and the screaming, and everything else. But this is one hell of a fucked up place hell. this is a hell this is um words can't describe it 
it's if you haven't been there been here you need to come and sit here people will say that you know that oh you're just doing this that but you have to be here to experience it to feel it brian being touched with all of us just being affected and what's come on and the necrophilia the radio and everything else what we've done it's just been uh it's bonkers it's just unexplainable it's um joshua it was my nephew. Oh really? Oh of course it was, yeah Josh. I've got a brother called Josh. Um, well. And the stuff what is coming out and what you're saying, it, it, it means things to us all. And well, I'll, I'll be, I haven't said it yet on camera and I'll say it now. Yeah. The reason when it said Michael Michael is here, when it said through all that and that, the reason I got all freaked out is my uh, stepdad was called Michael who died a couple of years ago. Oh. And that's why I was asking the questions I was asking. That kind of freaked really? me out a little bit. I was like, ooh. Um, so that was quite a intriguing one, and, and the fact it's mentioned in Joshua's which is my brother, which is his son. That's kind of, there's a few stuff that's been mentioned tonight, like it's mentioned my last name, and I was sure it, I heard it mentioned my old last yeah, name from here as well, Ambler. And, and, and on these these things it mentioned, we you know we can't fix it. It just happens. It says it, but it, it's saying things, and it said all things about all of us that that means stuff to us. We can't make up. How is it happening? We just don't know. But it's exploring the unknown. So I think, what a great night. And for the first one, the series, Fetch in Andy Gray Street. Andy, thanks for having us. No problem. It's, um, it's, been, a, it's been an experience that, you know, that I will, I think I will be having nightmares. Um, I was going to say it's been emotional, but it actually has been emotional. But there's been a lot of sadness. and The feelings have been up and down through us all. Yeah, yeah. It has, it, it's been, um, I can't describe it, I just don't know, I'm just, I'm just knackered, I'm tired, it, it, it's what I mean, and it's, it's draining, it's so, 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 so draining and that, and I don't, just, uh, what was that, what was that, I don't know, but that was just, like a growl, like, yeah, there's just a lot of weird stuff, there's a lot of energy, there's a lot of weird objects here, dolls and everything else and that, but, other than that, um, but uh, I just don't know. Just to finish off, Brad, what do you think? Because it's your first time you've been here as well. I think it's a crazy place, honestly, and the fact of the amount of um, things have had happen has just been insane. Like, I never expected to get this much, just this much activity no. in no. one place, in one night, and... Yeah, I don't know, it's the first one. It's been a hell of a night, it's been crazy. It's been a weird, weird night, but... Um, Terry, did somebody say Terry before? It said Terry a few times, and Terry came through one year at one point with Necrophonic. But it's still going on, as we can still carry on, but we're going to wrap it for a night. Obviously, it's, it's, it's good night from Brian, and it's good night from me, Steve, and it's good night from Andy. Good night. Sleep tight. Sleep tight. I thought we all do sleep tight. Um, and we'll see you again. It's over and out from the live. See you in the next episode.